Hi everyone, welcome back to the Laravel 7 tutorial. In this video, we are going to learn about HTTP session. All HTTP driven applications are stateless. Session provide a way to store information about the user across multiple requests. Laravel provides various drivers like file, cookie, array, redis, and database to handle session data. By default, file driver, uh, file driver is used because it is a lightweight. Uh, session can be configured using its configuration file. So let's see the session configuration file. So go to the project and uh, open config folder. So just go to the config folder and inside the configuration folder, uh, just click on session.php. Okay, this is the session.php file. Just open it and here you can see the system related configuration. All right, let's see how can we uh, use a station in Laravel. So, for that, create a controller. So, switch to the command prompt and uh, just write here php artisan make controller and controller name let's say controller name is session controller all right now press enter all right controller has been created now go to the session controller so just click on app folder then http and inside the controllers you can see your session controller so just open this file all right now here just create a function for access the session data so just write here public function Function name, let's say function name is get session uh, data. All right, inside this, just pass here the request dollar request. All right, curly bracket to start and close. And inside this, just write here if request arrow session. All right as let's say lesson key is name okay here has session method is sure that uh, that is the pass key is available or not okay and inside the if condition just get the session value so just write here Uh, echo dollar request arrow session all right and call the get method so just write on get and pass the key name which is name okay get session method retrieve data from session by its key name all right and in the else part Just write here, uh, just print the message, no data in the session. All right. Now create another method for storing session data. So just here, create another method, public function, function name. Let's say function name is a store session data all right and inside this just pass your request dollar request all right and here just try to request arrow session and call the put method so just write here put and pass the key name which is name and just write here our value let's say name is Jennifer 
all right inside the put uh, put method it takes two parameter first is key and uh, second is data okay here just echo a message so just write here data has been added to the session all right now create another method for deleting session data so just write here public space function name okay function function name the function name is delete session data all right and inside this just pass here request dollar request all right and inside this function just write here dollar request session arrow forget call the forget method for deleting so and inside this just pass here key name which is name all right here forget method will remove the session by the key name okay and after that just print a message echo data has been removed okay from the session all right okay now create uh, first of all save the file and create a route so create three route for this method this method and this method okay so go to the web.php file so just click on routes folder and inside the route just click on web.php and here just create three routes okay so just write here route get and uri let's say session get okay and controller name session controller at the rate method name so let's copy the method name from here so just copy this and paste here all right in similar way just create a second route route get and here just call session set all right then controller name session controller at the rate method name for storing which is store session data so copy and paste okay now third one route route eight and this is for deleting so just write here station remove okay controller name session controller at the rate method name and method name is delete session data okay so just copy and paste here all right now save the file and let's check so go to the browser and inside the browser just go to the url station first of all set the session so just write here session set okay now press enter data has been added to the session okay now get the session data so just write here which is the uri get. okay so just write here get you can see here session data uh, which was the Jennifer okay and finally just call the remove so just write here remove and press enter you can see here data has been removed for session from session if I get again no data in the session okay so this way you can use HTTP session in Laravel 
so that's all about from uh, http session so thanks for watching this video and if you still have any kind of question you can ask me in the comment box don't forget to subscribe my channel thanks for watching